No fight is unwinnable if we try our hardest. What's up, everybody? How you doing? Hope you like the new overlay. Uh, and it's got the shirt counter, too, for the shirts sold. Uh, once again, check out those shirts. They'll be below the, sh the YouTube and below the stream if you're watching on uh, stream right now. So be they'll be below the video, not the YouTube. I don't know where the YouTube is located. Probably somewhere in San Francisco. All right, let's go. We got Jing Wei, the girl herself. Versus Shibalanke. This is my first Jingwei YouTube game. I've played her a handful of times and I have been fucking loving her. I didn't think that I would, but I have been. Alright, Benny Q. Alright. Alright, me. Alright. You better back up, though. See what happens when you do, buddy. Alright, so we both suck, but I sucked slightly more, I think. Trying to make up for it, though, and I am. I am. Look at that, look at that damage. Yeah, look at that. Oof. We're both poking each other like crazy right now. Benny and I both feeling mad aggressive. His god is not great in the early, but he's got throwing dagger, so he is great in the early. Suddenly, right? That's how that works. Now, I've been thinking that this god is actually super fucking good. I might have underestimated or overestimated her because... No, actually, no. I underestimated the shit out of her at first. And now I think I think that she's really good. Maybe in, like, S+. Plus. Not S+. Plus. Uh, yes, maybe S+. Plus. We'll have to see, though. Because I don't think she can box the better hunters come late game. But watch what she can do here, right? If he wants to go do this fucking buff, I'm going to be here and I'm going to fuck him up. It's kind of crazy. Her farm potential is outstanding. See, I can actually see that he backed, and now I can just go and do my fucking blue buff. She has insane control. Insane. I probably should have even just went for the red buff, but I feel like I can just box him in the lane now. And go get that myself whenever the fuck I want. Like, it's gross, dude. Jing Wei. He's probably doing his red buff or his blue buff right now, actually, which leaves us a perfect opportunity to do the red as well. I'm never sure if it's worth. Well, it's definitely not worth getting hit twice by it, but I'm never sure if it's worth going into that thing. I think it is. I knew he juked that way. Let's go. Fuck. God damn. It was cool though. Right, it was super cool. Dun, 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 dun. But ult for ult. Ult for ult and I got both buffs. Feeling pretty good. So whenever she backs, she can just go get the full fucking wave. Like, it's incredible. We're already up 200 gold on this man and we haven't even done anything yet. I love it. I fucking love it. Look at that poke, baby. Look at it. I love it. So if you guys don't know, her one is both an attack speed steroid and a tremendous uh, damage uh, uh, ability. The attack speed steroid is you have to knock yourself up, though. That's the only awkward thing about it. But when you're knocked up, your three, which is your dash, it allows you to fly even further. So it's a very interesting kit that she has. It's very, um, what's the word? Very unique. Definitely very, very unique. Uh, and her ultimate kind of sucks for its actual damage, but it has the, I'm, I've been debating going, uh, no, actually, I was going to say I was thinking Ninja Tabby, but no, Warrior Tabby's, Warrior Tabby's good here. He's good. So she also gets a movement speed increase uh, if she... Where's the movement speed increase? What is that on? I feel like she gets a movement speed increase from something. Does she, you guys? No? No movement speed increase? I'm crazy? Alright, her 2 is uh, a branching bola, basically, but it has uh, crit chance on it. So, kind of crazy. Boom, boom, boom. 
But it's only three instead of, you know, uh, Shibanke is like a bajillion. So that would be why Branching Bola is a better AoE clear than her two. I like leveling the one right into the two. Oh, what's up, Hope? How you doing, man? Oh, she gets Fatalis effect from her three. I see. I hate that when it knocks you up and you don't want it to. Now, my thing is that I feel like she'll get outboxed by any of the hunters in the actual late game. But we will see. You definitely start off camps like this. Try to get that uh, burst damage off. I think I missed the actual burst damage on the creep himself, but whatever. Both buffs secured once again. He thinks that buffs up. I am Jing Wei. Get out of here. Even if he uh, makes me stay here. Oh, 1 plus 3 makes the Fatalis effect, I see. Even if he makes me stay there, I come back so quickly. I probably miss any creeps. Maybe I miss one creep. Yep. One creep in gold. Unless I do this wrong. No, I missed two creeps in gold. I just hate when I keep knocking myself up accidentally with that. It's the only thing I don't like. So yeah, we have that 200 gold lead. But we kind of get out traded a little bit. Unless I hit crits. Those crit stuff. So I don't know, man. We'll see. We'll see. Just try me, broski. And if he sticks around here, obviously I can kill him. So he has to back off. Even though he won that engagement, what did he get off of it? He spent his ultimate. I spent my meditation, but... He spends his ultimate, and he doesn't actually get any tower poke or uh, or extra farm over me. In fact, I return to the, to the lane qu more quickly than he does here. So it's just kind of nutty, dude. But I'm getting used to her, so I'm not really you know that accurate with my abilities on her yet. Bang, bang. Ah, okay. The three alone gives you. Six seconds immunity to basic attack. Oh, six seconds immunity to basic attack. Oh, I see. I see now. Ow. Why is he hitting so hard, dude? See, I keep fucking missing that, and it's annoying me. Because, like, you have to hit that. It's such a big part of her damage. Let me get out. Thank you. I'm gonna rush I'm gonna just try to rush him down because his late game will beat ours it sucks because Shibanke is so good right now because of uh, Golden Bow you know the only time he struggles is in lane and he doesn't really have a laning phase anymore he's just kind of always relevant yo hey, what's up Halls kind of like uh, Rama yay I can fly this is also a very good player, though, Benny Q. Masters, uh, Conquest player, you know, very strong in general. Played some SPL games as well, actually, uh, for Denial. I think he's their coach, officially. See, like, I feel like my trades are nothing to him right now. Why is that? Is he hitting me with bolas? What? He's got no mana. If he tries to go for that red buff, I'm gonna kill him right now. I don't care about the wave. Oh, you dead. And I got that. Oh, but he meditated. That was a smart meditation. I missed, uh, missed a little bit of the wave there, unfortunately. Nice win for him. But actually, I got the red, so win for me. Maybe I can get his blue as well. Oh, my two has less range in my basic attacks. That actually makes some sense then. 
Look at her escape potential. It is ridiculous. It is ridiculous. So should I level my three? What does it give me? Extra or you know lower cooldown? But I, I guess I'll level the ultimate anyway. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, she's really fun, dude. She's really fun. For sure. Oh, he's doing fire. Fucker. How did he know that I was coming? As a word, I guess. Damn, I suck with her so badly so far, dude. Gotta get better with her. Hopefully, as the game goes on, I, I get a little bit better at it. I'm going straight into the uh, chins here because I want to just like overpower him, but it's, I don't think it's happening is the problem, so I'll probably have to go into Devo awkwardly here. I think I just saw him around this corner. I'm crazy, dude. Sometimes I see people and they're just not there. Like, they're just not. Wow, look at my experience over his. See, like, I just find it so hard to hit that shit, but if you hit crits with her, that's the thing. If you hit crits on her, like, she is such a monster. It's nuts. Yeah, I feel like it's just been me misplaying uh, that's allowed him to box me that, this well here. my god what did I just do what did I just do I did the cancel thing dude everybody's been talking about that you can ult with her and cancel and I but what did I shoot at him just an auto and it killed him the auto crit him or what I had stacks on my two what the fuck I just eliminated him what happened to my man what just happened to that man I don't even understand. Time to dip though, because he's coming. Somebody please explain what just happened. I have no words. Alright, so I'm not going Devo, because now I get to snowball. Yeah, I am going to go Windy, man. I think it's worth on her. He walked into my one, did he? I don't know. But I canceled the fucking thingy, I'll tell you that much. I canceled my ultimate. So how does that work with canceling the ultimate? You can channel another ability while you do it or Oh god, why is he so fast? Wow, 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 what the fuck was that? How, why was he that fast? He didn't even sprint, he doesn't even have sprint! He just caught me running. Is my movement speed like ridiculously small? What the fuck? So yeah, Wind Demon, uh, not a pickup that I have uh, experimented too much in duel with. We're still ahead though is the thing, but we lost our tower and he's coming online as late game Shibanke and he has Devo over us and that's the thing. In an ADC duel, if you don't go Devo, you will lose in the late game. So what we were trying to do was uh, eliminate that factor by not allowing him to ever come online, you know? But unfortunately that is no longer going to be the case. His 3 doesn't give him movement speed though, right? Just gives him the dash. Oh shit, I left that wave. Nah, I didn't leave that wave, I left like two creeps on it. But he is probably at fire right now. Damn dude, Shibanke is too strong right now. For my little baby here. 
And Benny's playing, like, really well. I see you, buddy. Wow, that still hit. Fuck, dude, I hate Shibanke. You think his three does give movement speed? I don't think so. Are you kidding me? That ult has such a long cooldown. Damn, dude. I don't think we can make her work in this kind of a matchup. Shibanke just out 1v1s her. So I think against most other hunters, she'll lose. Whereas uh, a lot of the... Like, because I hit almost everything there. And we had a lead on him. Oh, but we didn't have defense, which was dumb. Did not have defense yet, which was dumb. We'll see. Maybe when I get defense online. But, like I said, uh, he's got dev gloves. If I had gone dev gloves this game, maybe it would have been a different story. I'd like to see. But right now, obviously, it's not going to quite go that way unless we have some sort of crazy significant outplay. We will try. Damn, I got a clear time. Look at that. My ult does literally nothing. It's just because of Nemean? Fuck. Fuck that shit. Alright, let's go see if we can get his thingy. Yeah, I gotta get a Nemean. He went Frostbound. Full fucking scum Benny key right now. I thought we were above this, Benny. Wow, I'm outboxing the shit out of him right now. I was. Uh, I hit every auto and he hit hardly any of them, but defense OP. Fuck. Dun, dun, dun. I guess I'll sell Ickful for the uh, defense. Or Golden Bow. I'm going to need the Golden Bow because he's going to have fire creeps here. Dude, I outboxed the living shit out of him. He had Shell too, though, which made up. Yeah. Damn. Hopefully we can kill him on the chase here, but I doubt it. Damn, man. So, yeah, she just straight up gets outboxed by other hunters. It's a shame. Oh, yeah. She just gets straight up outboxed. That is rough, dude. That is really rough. She just doesn't have the tools to, to, to make it in that, in that sort of 1v1 scenario, it looks like. Hyde is doing quite a little bit. Hyde's definitely doing a little bit. Maybe with a better build, like I said, it, it could have worked out. I'll try to work on her more with, with other builds, but that is rough, man. Like I said, defense earlier definitely would have been the key, uh, but I was trying to just snowball against him because I knew he'd win this late game as Shibanke. She balls late game is just too strong. Please no. I know if I saw yeah, he's missing so much is the thing. Win demon for hide, you think? And go. Uh, yeah, I definitely need this uh, golden bow right now for the clear. That's the key. I guess the crit, like, you can never rely on crit in duel, unfortunately. No matter what the circumstance. Even if I'm hitting a lot more than him and I'm trying to proc the uh, wing blade. It just doesn't work out. I am missing my ones, though, so, you know, while I'm out trading him in the actual, like, ADC part, I'm not, uh,. I'm not playing it well, like, as a caster. I'm doing no damage to him, and it's mostly because of the crit. I need to sell it for, uh... Titan's Bane, for sure. Shut up, Battle Rep! 
pa 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 Yeah, this build was ass cheeks. I want another go at this. I want another go. Fatalis, bro, boys. Oh, I should be able to see over his shit. Some damage. <laughs> no, no. I don't think there's anything she could do there, unfortunately. Although, like I said, my build wasn't on point either. We played it really... Um, in the actual ADC boxing matches, we played well, but I don't think that uh, that she's in any way capable of taking that against, you know, another evenly skilled, uh, better hunter. So, that's my, about my evaluation for her. I'm trying to think about where I'd put her on the tier list right now. And, um, I'm thinking off of that kind of performance. <laughs> off of that uh, performance, I'm thinking in the 1v1 scenario, while she's really strong in uh, in farm potential. Yeah, he thinks she's bad too. <laughs> um, God damn, dude. I've never seen this screen. That's crazy. Um, he thinks in conquest too. She's had a lot of uh, success in conquest though. Um, but yeah, I'm, I guess I'm thinking... Uh, I'm thinking probably about S. Um, maybe S minus. Because she is an ADC and she can shit on other gods just by out farming and by being present. I love this ending screen. This is so cool, dude. What the fuck? This is cooler than any victory screen. I would lose every game on this god. GG, thank you guys so much for watching. And yeah, Benny definitely outplayed me there in terms of ability, damage, and everything like that. It just seemed like my... Uh, uh, the only gripe I had was that my auto game was on point and his, you know, wasn't so much in that scenario and yet it didn't really matter. Uh, but a lot of that, again, was due to the build. Overall, though, I'd certainly say um, that, that she can't at all hold up to the other hunters. Like, you had the perfect build here, by the way. This is exactly what you need in uh, in an ADC ditto. I don't like building like this in most ADC dittos because, like, I, I just like playing aggressively. Like, if I'm playing an ADC, I'd rather play them to just, like, go ham and have fun. But if you're playing against another ADC, whether you're, you know, trying to go ham and have fun or not, if you want to win, you definitely got to do this kind of a build with uh, with Devo after the Ickful, uh straight into a uh, Nemean and uh, get that chin size online as well. I went for the more aggressive build, like I said, to try to shut him down early. I went into the Ickful, straight into chins, into Aussie, and it just unfortunately did not work out because his his early to mid was stronger than mine which was so unexpected because most gods that's why shibanke is rated lower is because uh he you know he loses during that early to mid stage so that's that's what surprised me um and i think that's a big reason uh that this one was kind of a loss from the start so yeah maybe s minus maybe even a plus uh, i gotta keep thinking i gotta keep uh you know trying her out with different builds different strategies so we'll see thank you for watching remember to subscribe